Hey everyone, welcome to another episode of Real Hazardous. We got some cool dolphin footage coming for you, so stay tuned. Hey guys, we got a really fun episode because today we are fishing with some of my relatives. We got my dad, of course, but I'm talking about my cousin Drew, cousin Hunter, cousin Brady, and cousin Tucker, along with my uncle Danny. I guess I didn't have to say cousin in front of each one of them. I don't go around saying cousin so-and-so. We are going offshore for Mahi in the evening. We're going to do a little evening fishing trip. It's a good time to fish in the evening. Uh, it's cooler. The fish bite picks back up. Sometimes it's less crowded, so that's a big plus. It's a nice day, calm, which is nice. Some of the days have been windy. We head out and we're about uh, 12 miles offshore, about 600 feet of water, kind of hit that drop off and we find a good weed line. So we start trolling right there. Put out the spread, put out some squid teasers that I like to pull, especially down the keys. I got a, a ballyhoo out in one, a little chin weight I rigged, and then we've got some rattle jet lures and a little feather. We start trolling the weed line and um, you know, it's, sometimes trolling a weed line is kind of difficult because you're like, oh man, this is just a giant weed line down the keys. Sometimes the grass is broken up so you get uh, tangled in your hooks a lot. And um, sometimes there's not a clear place where to start. You know, sometimes one side is less grassier than the other. Sometimes like it's more defined edge on one side. So if you find that, try to hit that edge and troll with that. And as we're going, you know, we see different chunks of it, and sometimes you'll find stuff floating in it. And what we did was we got our first hookup um, on the rattle jet. And it was funny because it was a bar jack. It hits it. Okay, my dad has it up high in the tower. He's kind of watching up there. We get this bar jack on, pass the rod down to Hunter. Hunter starts reeling in the fish, you know, bringing in, bringing in. And as it gets close, my dad in the tower says, oh, there's a dolphin right behind it. Let it back like man so so he lets it back starts letting back and the dolphin hits the bar jack here we go i think i got color bar jack. hey there's a mahi behind it there's a mahi behind it where'd he hit he's right, he's right on it he's right on it let it rip he's on there now really? <laughs> there we go look at him look hey hey right here right at the boat drew we got some right here right at the boat here, take one of these uh, spinners. So we had a rattle jet lure, a bar jack hit that, and then a dolphin hit the bar jack with our rattle jet lure, and once you know it, he gets hooked up. We get the fish coming up, and it gets a little chaotic because I see other dolphin by the boat. So I'm like running around, you know, we got a big crew. I'm running up to the front and getting some uh, cut bait chunks uh, so I can kind of chum the other dolphin up. You know, have some other little pieces we can put on some little uh, J hooks. I was using some, I mean, some four alt owner J hooks or some little five alt mustad hooks. Um, so that's what we do. As Hunter's getting his fish up, I'm seeing more fish. I'm throwing out some lines, some bait, and we got school coming up. So it's really exciting. It's a really good sign. Stay back, guys. Whoa, look at that. I ain't lying. Here's more right around the boat. Hey, guys, we got more. We get hunters in the boat, and it's a nice dolphin. You know, it's pretty cool. Pretty excited about it. So then we get hooked up to the second fish, and they're fighting that. We we try the little trick. You keep one in the boat till you get the next one hooked up. We had a couple little hookups, but they kind of got off. But it's okay, because now that we got that hit in those fish, we know the dolphin are here. So what we start doing is this chunk, this particular part of the weed line, nothing particularly setting it apart, making it different, but what we do is we troll it. We troll it maybe a hundred yards one way, come back through and go a hundred yards past where we got the fish. So we're going back and forth. My dad's up in the tower and sometimes he can see him. So just keeping an eye out, even if you don't have a tower, you know, you can stand up on your gun or on a cooler, or just, just watching, you know, they'll come right by you sometimes. Keep an eye out. And now that we've caught fish, we're working this part of the weed line. We keep trolling and boom. Get another dolphin on. Get school back up. Look at him. There you go. Come on, Brady. Catch the mahi, buddy. There's yeah. a bunch of them in there. Somebody. Whoa! Look at that. <laughs> oh, yeah. 
I might have that on video, Jeremy. Nice. <laughs> okay. You want to keep it in water? Uh, you got another one, Dad? Yeah, hang it. Hold it there for just a second. Yeah. <laughs> hang on, hang on. We can cut these. There you go. Let me chum them up a little for you. I got one on this one right now. Come here, Tucker. Why is it on the hook? He's got a barge there. Hey, what's that, Dad? Just rope? Yeah, that's one. Wait, he's under the motor, though. Nice. Keep, keep him out. There we go, guys. Hey, where'd, uh, where'd Hunter go? Hunter. Oh, uh, <laughs> that's like crap. Sorry, Drew. <laughs> Brady caught this one, right? We gotta figure out how to make it. I got I it. I caught the blade. Okay. Oh, Brady. Come here, Brady. <laughs> Rabbit Jet does it again. We dropped him back. He hit him. He hit him. Huh? Utter chaos. Yeah. Yeah. I can't believe he came, kept coming back and hitting it. He hit it about four times before he got it. Again. Hey, hooked Tucker, up. Are you ready? I'm ready, but how We're do hooked I get that? You don't. He's just going to hand it down to us. Hooked up again. Got it. Got it. Oh, look at him jumping. Okay, let's get our uh, our uh, pitch pitch baits ready. Pitch baits ready. I can figure it out. Actually, I think that is all. <laughs> Dad, just reel, reel in. Don't make, make sure we don't tangle him up. Hey, Y'all kids, get ready. We're going to catch them all. Oh, Keep them going. There you go, man. There you go. Oh, yeah. Let them go. Pretty fish. Uh, hand that to my dad in just a second. So the rattle jet did good for us again. We also got a hit on our ballyhoo. Um, sometimes it's harder for those. I think you got to um, kind of let the fish get to the hook because the ballyhoo can be kind of big. And we're using ballyhoo we caught down there in the Keys. So it's not exactly a small ballyhoo, which would be good for smaller dolphins. So if it's a big one, sometimes when they hit it, you know, let them eat it so they can get all the way up to that J hook, which is, you know, closer to the front. Drew, is this your first bar jack? Yes, yeah, I believe it. Wow. Is. Yeah. It's, uh, it's gonna it's been be a, long, been a long, long time coming. Right. It's tough to reel in. That's, it that's why I'm, you're going so slow. It. You have one of those like belts. I do. You want it? A little. Probably need the fighting push it. chair. Fighting chair. Yeah. We're just sticking in the rod holder and let her reel. One of those hooks would be good on the belt. Mm -hmm. We're hoping something will take it on the way up. Overall, it was a lot of fun fishing. We had a great time, it was cool. Glad I got to fish with my cousins in the Keys. Haven't got to do that before. We had a great time, uh, caught some good fish. It was a lot of fun. Mom, First I one. Board jack. Huh? I got a board jack. Did a board jack. First one had a big strip, a live bait strip. I got some more bait. Like a live, slow trolling and overgrown live poke. Right. So is my bar jack still in the, inside the other <laughs> <No>. one? <laughs> <laughs> we'll cut it out and uh, you can have it later. Did we ever get the broom? Did you ever get that broom? I it's did. It's out. And then you started screaming something because I ran to the front. <laughs> and we got a fish on and then uh, all heck broke loose again. <laughs> Pretty much. Fish, fish outweigh is the cleaning of the boat. That's right. I don't know, you seem very excited to clean. Let's do it again. Hang on, hang on. <laughs> He's got me hooked and he's trying to... Dang, watch yourself, Drew. It ain't me, he's getting... Yeah. We're also, we're gonna be doing some videos with cousin Drew, okay? Again, Drew, cool dude, really good fisherman, okay? A lot of cool stories. We're going to tell some stories one day um, and just have a good time fishing. We talked about maybe even getting together and doing a toad fishing episode. If you guys want to see a toad fishing episode, you let me know. We'll do it. Not a lot of, uh, you know, spotlight for the toad fish. What can I say? 
Um, they're one of those under, uh, they're probably rated about right, <laughs> pretty low. But hey, we're gonna do an episode on it anyways, right? How about you, Drew? Close this out. Cousin Drew. Thankful for a Bortac. Happy to be part of a legendary undertaking. Thank you. Bar jacks. Right. You know, they don't get a lot of credit. I mean, they when's really the last don't. time you turned to a fishing show and said, today we're going after bar jacks? Right. I mean, you know, it's kind of a, you know, a lost art. We're actually yeah. working on a toadfish episode. Really? Want to be a part of that. He's top 10 in the world. Yeah. My father. Eight, maybe 10 people in the world. You can be Right. You, give, you give him a mud man and a kale hook. Toadfish, beware. Ah, Sounds good. I Scare. am a toad fisherman. All toad fishermen. There we oh. go. Now I don't catch them little baby ones. No, right. uh, ain't them big old ones. Right, we don't waste our time with babies. Right. Right. Big boys. Right. Well, anyways, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. Learned some tips and tricks. Don't forget to subscribe, and we'll see you next time. Probably be doing some more videos with these guys in the near future.